What's going on guys, Plastic Beach X3 back here with another One Piece Local Duel video and this time is going to be round 3 of the double box tournament at Bulldog Community Gaming. Um, this is round 3, I didn't do round 1 or 2 yet because they were both Zoro versus Yamato and I didn't want to already, like my most recently posted video is Zoro versus Yamato so I didn't want to post 3 different Zoro versus Yamato in a row. Um, so we're going to start with round three and I'll post rounds one and two later, but it's Whitebeard versus Zoro. Whitebeard starts with Nami, Zoro starts with, um, Izo, and then Whitebeard swings five with Nami, six with leader, 2k, take 2k, pass turn. Like I said, this is a double box tournament. We top cutted to top four um, after four rounds of Swiss. Also, um, today as I'm filming this, I'm going to be starting to print off OPO4 proxies. Um, so be on the lookout for some OPO4 testing videos, similar to how I did the 03 testing videos where I would just print off proxies and play IRL games with them. Um, Whitebeard plays Marco, pops the Izo, pass turn. Zora goes six at life, he'll counter with a Marco, and then play Marco of Zone, pass turn. We'll go seven at life. Take, seven at life, take, play Marco, pass turn. Zoro goes a clean six. Whitebeard will take it because he's going to take it next turn anyway. Seven into six. Or sorry, eight into six. He'll block and recover with uh, by discarding ace. Play Zoro. Swing six at life. One K, another six at life. Two K, pass turn. Play Ace, reduce the two Zoros. Or not, reduces the Zoro and a Marco. I'll go six into two, six into, doesn't matter, Dis let's a die, discards Red Hawk to revive. And then eight into five. Yeah, I think you should have just reduced the two Zoros. Um, 
Like, all your characters are 6k, so... Um, reducing the Marco gets one card out of his hand in form of, of an event. Or, uh, and also just swinging 6 into it also gets one card out of their hand, so... It was the same on the if you minus the Marco or not, so probably should just minus the Zoros, because you could have got punished if you rad beamed up the Zoro. But ended up not getting punished. Go to six at life, seven at life. Curly, search buggy. Buggy, search. I didn't see what he searched, but if he's even made a decision yet. Fire Fist. Play Zone Marco Blocker. Play Fossa, pass turn. Go seven into life with Marco. Block with Fosa. Seven into life with Ace. Take it. No trigger. Seven into life with Leader. Block and resurrect. Discarding Whitebeard Pirates. Play Rush Luffy. So it was obviously smart to block the Whitebeard swing um, so that you don't get Rush Luffy. Seven and alive, he'll take it. Last turn, two dawn up, one blocker. Six cards in hand.
doing the Yu-Gi-Oh calculations on his calculator mat. Decides he can't win, plays boogie. Unless he draws something, I guess. Maybe like a fire. Oh, he was probably looking for an event with the fire fist in hand. Uh, because he discarded white beard pirates off of the Marco blocker. And he whiffed on the buggy search. That sucks. He'll play Machino, boost buggy, boost buggy with another Machino, making Mach buggy go up plus six to nine with leader is 10. Decide to go nine into life. Make him have the beam. Red beam 1k. Or sorry, not red beam. Guard point 1k. Go down to four in hand with a blocker. One done. Go eight into life. You know, two K, two K. Six in the life, one K, six in the life, two K. And past turn, so white white beer gets it. Moves on to round four of the double box tournament. GG's to those guys. Make sure to subscribe to Plastic Beach X3 for more one piece videos and peace out.